Christian leader blames gay sex, abortion, and um, let's say adult video content for the New Zealand cyclone. Recently, Brian Tamaki of the Destiny Church in New Zealand suggested that Cyclone Gabriel, a storm that recently devastated New Zealand and parts of Australia, was caused by homosexuality and, can I say the P word? Yeah, go ahead. And pornography. <laughs> <laughs> he claimed <laughs> that the storm hit the towns of um, Gisborne and Hastings in New Zealand the hardest because they have, quote, the highest number of porn watchers in the country. Tamaki backed his claims by saying that he hopped on a porn site to research the perversion linked to bad weather. <laughs> He also said New Zealand was designated for destruction because it has, quote, the queerest parliament in the world. <laughs> he continued his rant saying, please stop watching porn, New Zealand. It's getting us in trouble. By the way, I don't watch porn. <laughs> In response <laughs> to these remarks, Rahet Stoltz, Gisborne's uh, mayor, told the online magazine The Spinoff that his claims were disappointing, unhelpful, and laughable. <laughs> he actually ended it with, by the way, I don't watch porn? Yes, yes. Can I, oh I can God. pull up some of his um, other quotes from this, this rant, because it was pretty hilarious. In our news article, we have um, some of his tweets that was pretty awesome. That's amazing. <laughs> yeah, watcher saying, by the way, I don't watch porn. Why so defensive? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, nobody did. Were people asking? <laughs> what was he? Oh, my God. Or, is this guy famous? He seemed like a big deal. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know what goes on in New Zealand. I don't know how influential this guy is. People were trolling him pretty hard on um twitter so <laughs> wait go open up our article and scroll there's oh, yeah. <laughs> our editor d put in such a good meme scroll down so he, here's a tweet that he had on twitter he says like it or not there is no denying that cyclone gabriel is an act of god and who better to talk about an act of god than a man of god read more here and then scroll down a little bit someone replied to it <laughs> and said your theology is bad and you should feel bad <laughs> <laughs> so good. oh my god oh god does it go in yeah yeah yeah, yeah. How religious really is, new, is new zealand that religious i can't believe this it's crazy so here's some here are some other quotes from him he's saying that this happened in new zealand because they have the, this these towns in new zealand because they had the highest number of porn watchers in the country um he said that uh that the, this game this um cyclone was an act of a god brought on by the moral depravity and degradation of porn users which he must have concluded after watching hours of porn <laughs> and then um he also said uh they're about these two towns that got hit hard he said and they're the biggest watchers of the porn site the porn sites of gay porn i know and i closed it and thought i can't do this in church i can't say this publicly <laughs> I love him saying, um, please stop watching poor New Zealand. It's getting us in trouble. And by the way, I don't watch porn. <laughs> Wait, it was I thought, this I... is so funny. He's saying this guy actually watched porn for research purposes. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, aren't, isn't New Zealand more famous for shagging sheep? Wouldn't that be more, the more um, likely reason for cycle? Me? Excuse isn't me? Isn't New Zealand... Like, isn't New Zealand a country famous for the people there shagging sheep? Um, this is the first time I've heard this <laughs> slanderous claim. <laughs> <laughs> it is. What? Is they're famous? They, I know that yeah. they, Dylan, I know that they have more sheep than they oh have people, but I didn't ever. I've never heard about them doing anything except shearing the sheep. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'm I'm pretty sure. Sakai I'm pretty is sure saying that's... that is Scotland, Armin. Sakai, I will not take this slander against my, my ancestors <laughs> and my heritage, okay? This is <laughs> slanderous. How dare you say this about my people? <laughs> I'm so offended. 
Oh yeah, Terrell is saying I was gonna say that that's actually Pakistan, but then I realized that was actually goats. Yes, goats for me, yeah, Pakistan. But I'm pretty sure New Zealand is famous for shagging sheep. I'm almost certain. I'm almost certain. What? Are you, where are you getting this from? Where are you getting this, this from? Is... Look, Shane is confirming this. Most this, of Kiwis no, lose their virginity. No, 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 no. I'm not buying this. All, to, all, to all my New Zealanders out there, all my Kiwis, Mataora, okay? I will not accept this link. I'm, act I'm actually having a little bit of a trauma right now because I was trying to do research about this to see if it's true, and mm -hmm. I did not like what I saw. I'm actually, I'm actually about to do. <laughs> I was... <laughs> I am. I, I just, I'm, I'm a little bit like distracted right now because I'm trying to clean my uh, like the mental image of I, I, the thing that I just saw. I, I, I don't even know how to talk. About what have you just done stuff. to yourself? I don't know. What don't have you just done to yourself? It. I don't want to oh talk. Oh my god. <laughs> That's okay. wow. That's just yeah. why there's no safe way to research these things. Oxymoron is saying, weren't you Irish last time around? Believe it or not, people can actually have multiple <laughs> ethnicities. <laughs> Especially yeah. when you're a white American. You're probably a whole I'm a mutt. I'm a mix of a lot of a lot of stuff. This is why the pure Aryans in Iran say United States is having a crisis of identity because they're a mix of so many <laughs> things that we have no. <laughs> this is this is what they're I don't even know this who is what they Iranian are anymore. You know, no, no, like they're all over, but they, they actually brag about this. They're like, look, if you look at my my ancestors, they all came from Iran. But if you go to America and they do a DNA test, they're just they're just a mix of so many things that that's why they have no identity to fall back on. Oh my god, racist talk. Racist talk. Yeah. Well, actually, this is really interesting because speaking of New Zealand, I was on a plane flight yesterday and I made friends with a Maori guy that yeah. I was sitting next to, and we were talking about his ancestry and the Maori have a very different concept of an like sacred ancestry or sacred lineage called like fucka papa. And I made friends with him because I actually like know these terms and I um could I he's like you you pronounced it right like how do you know this da 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 which goes on to show you guys that this is why it is so awesome to live in a multicultural society, to be interested in other cultures. Because if you just know a little bit, a little bit about someone else's culture and you show curiosity towards it when you ask them about it, it is the best way to make friends. Like he he was so impressed that I knew the word, the the, the Maori word for the the facial tattoos, the mukul, and and about the the really authentic tattoos that they do down their sides that on the thighs that most people like don't know about, like um all this stuff. And the Faka Papa, like um yeah. And this is a great way to make friends with people. So be curious about other cultures, learn about other cultures and make friends, guys. Okay. Multiculturalism is based. <laughs> That's my message for today. <laughs> hey, actually, our editor, please cut that part out. That was a pretty good. That was a pretty good. Insight. I want a little rainbow. Multiculturalism is based. <laughs> you should put a rainbow here. Mm. Uh, get my best-selling book, Why There Is No God, for free. Click on the link for it in the description.